Hello, my name is Arjun and I'm your instructor for application packaging training course. And in this video, we will see the course introduction. Well, what is application packaging? Uh, it's nothing but customizing the applications according to the uh, Windows operating system that we have and developing Windows installers. Windows installer, it's a technology that is introduced by Microsoft in the year 2000 and we have different versions of Windows installer in the last 10 years. Currently running Windows installer version is uh, Windows installer 5.0. So for Windows installer, we have two major tools to develop MSI installer files. One is Wise Package Studio and the other is Install Shield Admin Studio. So using these tools we can create, develop and modify, customize, can do whatever we want on MSI files. So application packaging is about learning how to develop MSI files and to customize the existing MSI files so that we can install, remove the applications from Windows operating system as we require. Why are we learning this application packaging? If you take an example of installing an application onto a system, what do you generally do? You trigger the installation of an application by double clicking the setup.exe. Yeah. After that, you go through the installation wizard by clicking next and providing the serial key and selecting or deselecting some of the features all this stuff but once we do some customizing the application that is packaging the application no need to uh, worry about what to select and what not to select inside the application packaging process it uh, it goes into robustic procedure where all the customizations, settings, everything will be built or embedded inside the package. And finally, you get a output such that without any user interaction, the application gets installed. So that is making mass deployments easier and automated installations without user interaction. And to have a robust desktop environment, which is nothing but Every user will not have to go and try to provide his information while ap application is getting installed. Everything is embedded inside the package and the administrator runs the package from a remote machine or a remote server. So that all the desktop environment in an organization will be robust, secure and safe. Which means once the application is packaged, we can maintain it easily and total cost for the organization will be reduced by implementing this application packaging. Next, so what if we do not package applications? If an application is not packaged, might be the application is in the form of a legacy installer is nothing but a uh, installer developed using some programming language. The developer might not know how to secure or make the operating system secure and what are the processes that needs to be followed. He might not know. So poor admin experience is nothing but uh, the administrator has to go through all the installation wizard on each and every machine to make the application install and destabilizing the OS and other apps. If application is not developed in a proper way, the operating system may get destabilized or other applications which are present on that system at any given point of time may get corrupted and poor development experience. It's because of the poor development experience, the applications may not work properly on each and every operating system. Next, so what are the benefits of application packaging? 
one is consistency all the applications will follow same rules for the particular organization or a particular windows desktop environment so uh, all the applications or the packages will be certified against some rules customizing the application is nothing but making some changes to the existing application so that they follow some strict rules or secure principles advertisement it's one of the uh, advantage of application packaging uh, at this moment you might not be able to understand what is advertisement but it's it's a kind of restoring the files when some of the application related files or settings might got get corrupted due to some various reasons and this again the same self healing of applications and rollback rollback is one more important advantage in application packaging that is during an installation of an application due to some reason maybe the installation is failed and what this msi file will do is instead of cancelling the installation then and there itself it will remove those maybe files or registries which were installed till that point of time so that the windows will be in clean state instead of getting corrupted so these are few of the advantages so what are the package types which will be developed generally manually authored msi that is the candidate who tries to package the application creates the msi on his own repackaged msi is nothing but we are converting a legacy application that is an install exe installer into msi format and tailor vendor supplied msi it's nothing but already the application is in the msi format and you are trying to customize the application according to your requirements and scripted installation is the final one which is nothing but you are creating some script to install the application so these are various ways where we can create the packages let's see a user trying to install an application which is not packaged many users will not have an idea on what to select and what not to select for configuring an application they will be in dilemma I have an application that is packaged and let's see how the installation takes place when the installation is triggered it just goes off silently without asking for any user input all the settings and configurations will be embedded inside the package and everything will be installed on the system finally when the user launches the application it launches perfectly without any error Thank you for listening and this is the end of course introduction.